warehouse clubs, the more you spend, the more you save. What? Hi there, my name is Mindy Jensen and I'm the host of the Bigger Pockets Money Podcast. Now, I totally own this super cheesy and clickbaity title, but it's also true. Let me explain. Let's start with my personal favorite, Costco. Costco is a membership warehouse, meaning you have to pay them to shop there. Memberships cost $60 for their Gold Star Basic Membership and $120 for their Executive Membership. Now, for years, I bought the Basic Membership because why would I pay twice the price for the exact same thing? Why? Rebates, that's why. The executive membership gives you a 2% annual rebate on eligible Costco and Costco travel purchases, including gas and groceries. If you spend $3,000 a year at Costco on eligible purchases, you'll receive $60 back in your rebate. That's the extra cost of the executive membership. And if you're like me and have kids, it is it was super easy to spend way more than $3,000 a year at Costco. In fact, every year since I have upgraded to the executive membership, I have received a rebate that is more than than the entire cost of my executive membership, making it free. And Costco has great product, like organic produce for reasonable prices, super fresh meat and fish, and inexpensive eggs and milk. You can buy appliances, get discounts on travel. They sell clothes, shoes, outdoor furniture, indoor furniture, grills, bikes, Halloween costumes, Christmas decorations, pretty much everything you need. They even have a tire center with really great prices. The only downside is nothing if you're me and have two children who eat like linebackers. However, there can be some downsides to shopping at Costco. They sell large quantities of almost everything. If you can't eat a gallon of mayonnaise before it goes bad, it's not really a bargain, is it? And that fresh meat I mentioned, it's sold in eight pound packages, not one pound packages, which is awesome if you have kids like me, but not so great if you are a single lady who doesn't routinely make giant meals. And if you live in a tiny apartment and you don't have a chest freezer in your non-existent basement, you might not have any place to store that extra meat. If you live in a major city and you don't have a car, you might not even be able to get all these giant packages to your house. Now, this isn't to say that a Costco membership wouldn't still serve you well. They sell a lot of household supplies at great prices too. And almost every store has a gas station and their gas prices are cheaper than almost any other station around. Go Banking Rate says, on average, groceries cost $300 a month for one person. Now, this seems a little bit low to me, but that's still $3,600 a year. Throw in cleaning supplies, random clothes, toiletries, and gasoline, and you're kind of getting paid to shop at Costco. If you don't have a Costco in your area, look into BJ's Wholesale Clubs. They have a similar 2% rebate membership, and their memberships are $55 and $110, respectively. Now, I don't live near a BJ's, and I don't have any personal experience with their clubs, but I have friends who do, and they love them almost as much as I love Costco. Walmart also has a warehouse membership called Sam's Club, and they have a similar rebate membership as well. Research wholesale membership warehouses in your area to find the one that offers the best options for you. Do you have a warehouse membership? Which one do you like best? Leave us a comment below, and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more information about building wealth and becoming financially independent. For Bigger Pockets Money, this is Mindy Jensen, signing off.